Hi everyone, welcome to the session. In this session, I will explain the problems related to permutations and combinations. Uh, uh, till now, in the last sessions, up to last session, we have discussed about uh, linear arrangement. Now, in this session, we are going to discussing about uh, circular arrangement. Look at the first problem which is given. Find the number of ways, find the number of ways in which a family of 12 persons in which a family of 12 persons uh, which includes a newly wed couple sit around a circular dining table so that newly wed couple always sit next to each other. Here sentence is very clear that as we are talking about circular dining table total 12 members are there in that 12 members he is particularly mentioning about a newly wed couple. Suppose, for example, let us take only newly wed couple. These are the two persons A and B. These two persons are newly wed couple persons. Still, we left over with 10 members, right? These are the 10 members, remaining 10 members. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, and uh, 9, 10. These are the remaining 10 members. 10 members plus uh, these are the two members. Uh, 12 members total. Now, I am not arranging at, uh, see if you observe carefully, here the condition which is given as, uh, we need to arrange all the 12 members in a circular dining table, but the condition is very important. Uh, newly wet couple always sit next to each other. These two couple, these two members are always sit next to each other. Next to each other in the sense definitely you need to take uh, these two members as a single entity. Single entity. Why? Because uh, if, you, if you are not taking as a single entity, then these two members can, it is possible to split into another way. So, in order to make all these two members as uh, sit always next to each other, we have to make them as a single entity. Now, these two members are single entity, still 10 members are there. 10 plus 1 single entity, 11. 11 members can be arranged in a circular manner, that is 10 factorial. As we know that uh, when we are arranging persons in a circular, uh, circular manner, then the number of ways are n minus 1 factorial. Here, total 11 members are there. 10 plus 1 single entity, 11 members. 11 members can be arranged in 11 factorial ways. 11 persons uh, can be arranged in, uh, sorry, 11 minus 1, that is 10 factorial ways. Answer is not yet completed. Again, in this single entity, A and B can interchange their positions. A right side is B or else B right side is A. There are two possible cases. So, those two members within the single entity can be arranged in two factorial ways. Therefore, our required answer is 10 factorial into 2 factorial. So, many students will do the mistake at this point only. They will directly write a 12 persons in a circle that is 11 factorial that is the answer but this is wrong way of thinking here the condition is very important newly wet couple always sit next to each other it means you need to take those two members as single entity single entity plus 10 members to 11 members can be arranged in a circular manner that is 10 factorial ways 11 minus 1 okay and next Within the single entity, again, you can arrange newly wet couple, two members in two factorial ways. 10 factorial into two factorial, that is the required answer for this question. No need of doing the calculation, okay? Let's move on to the next question. See here, very important. In a G20 meeting, in a G20 meeting, there were total 20 people representing their own country. Total 20 people are there. All the representatives sat around a circular table. All 20 members sat around a circular table. I don't want to mention each and every person, 20 members. Uh, and uh, look at the condition which uh, what is given. Find the number of ways in which uh, 
suppose uh, if there is no condition if you want to arrange 20 people in a circle it is very simple the required number of ways are 20 minus 1 factorial that is 19 factorial this is the answer without any condition but here there is a condition given so your answer is not 19 factorial okay keep it in mind now the condition is uh, listen or uh, read this sentence carefully find the number of ways in which we can arrange them around a circular table so that there is exactly one person there is exactly one person between two representatives uh, namely manmohan and musharraf here there are one person exactly one person sit between manmohan and musharraf manmohan and uh, musharraf and uh, so that you need to take these three as single entity why because uh, here he directly mentions that exactly one person is there between manmohan and uh, musharraf uh, you need to fix these three positions and you need to take these three as single entity as like previous problem and uh, out of 20 people 70 or uh, three members are already completed still you left over with uh, 17 17 plus one single entity 18 18 members can be arranged in a circle that is 18 minus 1 factorial base which is equal to 7 factorial your answer is not yet completed why because here within the single entity within the single entity this middle position is always fixed why because uh, here the condition is exactly one person sits between uh, manmohan and musharraf between manmohan and musharraf uh, one person so you can interchange uh, these two persons uh, musharraf and manmohan but you cannot interchange uh, this middle person these two members can be arranged in two factorial ways uh, manmohan and musharraf therefore the required answer for this question is uh, 17 factorial into 2 factorial 17 factorial into 2 factorial that is the required answer for this question let's move on to the next question see here there are three boys and four girls there are three boys and four girls uh, seated around a circular table so that no two boys are together so that no two boys are together let us take uh, a circle let us take a circle and uh, given that there are three boys and uh, four girls total there are three boys and four girls uh, according to the condition no two boys are together if you want no two boys are together first of all what you have to do is uh, you need to arrange the girls first here girls are four members how many girls are there four girls these four girls initially can be arranged in uh, three factorial ways only why because uh, four girls in a circle as we are arranging them in a circle you can arrange four girls in a circle in three factorial ways once it is done according to the question no two boys are together it means uh, boys must be sit uh, between the girls uh, between the girls how many places are left over we have four places we have four places and we need to arrange only three we need to arrange only three boys out of uh, four arranging three boys out of four places that happened in uh, four p three ways now the required answer is 3 factorial into 4p3. What is 3 factorial? 6. And 4p3 is equal to 24. 4p3 means what? 4p3 or 4 factorial both are same. 24. 24 into 6 which is equal to 144. 144 ways. That is the required answer for this question. Guys, uh, these kind of problems are whenever these kind of problems are given, first you need to arrange the girls uh, and uh, after that wh whatever the places are left over suppose if there are uh, uh, four boys are there in the question you need to arrange all the four boys in four places in four factorial ways there is no doubt in that here the answer for this question is uh, 144 in this way you can solve these kind of problems uh, 
guys i hope you understand the session thank you thank you very much for watching